3 raised to the power n minus 2 raised to the power n is equal to 65. What is the value of n? Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we quickly want to find the value of n from this nice Mount Olympiad question. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Solution. We have the given question 3 raised to the power n minus 2 raised to the power n is equal to 65. Take note of this the exponential rule that a raised to the power n to the power of m is equal to a raised to the power n m which is equal to a raised to the power m to the power of n. Now this equation let's add a trick here we have 3 raised to the power n over 2 over 2 minus 2 raised to the power n all to the power of 2 over 2 then is equal to 65. This does not necessarily change the exponent because 2 divided by 2 will also give you 1. Then from this rule, this is 3 raised to the power n over 2 square minus 2 raised to the power n over 2 square is equal to 65. Then let 3 raised to the power n over 2 is equal to a and 2 raised to the power n over 2 is equal to b. Then this is a square minus b square is equal to 65. This is different of 2 square. Then take note of this rule that if you have s square minus y square, this is equal to s plus y multiplied by s minus y. Then where s is equal to a and y is equal to b. Now we have a plus b multiplied by a minus b is equal to 65 but 65 is equal to 5 multiplied by 13 an integer solution a plus b multiplied by a minus b is equal to 5 multiplied by 13 but if you look at this, this is greater than this. So therefore, 13 is greater than 5. We have a plus b is equal to 13. Let's call this equation 1. And also, a minus b is equal to 5. Let's call this equation 2 where a and b are positive integer so let's see we have let's add equation one and two together if you had equation one and two together this one will cancel this then a plus a this is 2a is equal to 13 plus 5 18 let's divide both sides by 2 divided by 2 divided by 2 this one will cancel this 2 here 1, 2 here 9. Therefore, A is equal to 9. Now, we can solve for B. Let's solve for B using any of the equation, either equation 1 or 2, but let's make use of equation 2. Equation 2 is A minus B is equal to 5, where A is 9. This is 9 minus b is equal to 5. Now, minus b is equal to 5 minus 9. 
minus b is equal to minus 4 then b is equal to 4 that is the value of b but 3 raised to power n over 2 is equal to a then or 2 raised to power n over and 2 raised to power n over 2 is equal to b so this is 3 raised to power n over 2 is equal to a is 9 then we have 3 raised to power n over 2 is equal to 9 is 3 squared they have the same base theory then what with the exponent n over 2 is equal to 2 let's multiply both side by 2 we have 2 multiplied by n over 2 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 this one will cancel this n is equal to 4 that is the value of n also let's check when 2 over n over 2 is equal to b then we have 2 raised to power n over 2 is equal to b and b is 4 we have 2 raised to power n over 2 is equal to 4 then 2 raised to power n over 2 is equal to 4 is 2 square they have the same base n over 2 is equal to 2 then n is equal to 4 if you cross multiply so that is the value of n you can see that is correct let's check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong we have the given equation 3 raised to power n minus 2 raised to power n must be equal to 65 then n is equal to 4 we have 3 raised to power 4 minus 2 raised to power 4 must be equal to 65 so this is 3 raised to power 4 is 81 minus 2 raised to power 4 is 16 let's see must be equal to 65 then 81 minus 16 that is 65 which is equal to 65 which satisfy the given equation at n is equal to 4. If you enjoy the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.